Step number three, setting up your channel, engaging the visitor. A lot of people think that YouTube is all about creating a simple account, uploading videos like crazy, not caring about setting up the channel, and then they think they will start making crazy money with all the traffic they will get once their videos are live. But let me tell you, that is not the way it works. There are specific steps you need to take in order to create a highly successful YouTube money-making machine. And I'm going to show you the vital ones so you don't waste your time. Time is money. There are five vital components you will need to edit inside your YouTube channel. Those components are icon, art, description, links, and URL. Now let's go and set up our channel live. To set up and customize our channel, you just need to go to the YouTube links area and click where it says My Channel. YouTube will automatically set up a default channel under your Google profile, but if you click OK, you will set up that default account with your name. If you click the blue link, you will be redirected to the area to set up the channel with a different title and category. Here we will place the name of our channel, and here we will select the category. Make sure your content is appropriate. Check the box that says you agree to the terms. And finally, click where it says Done. Great, the channel was created. Now the new awesome thing in YouTube is that you are able to set up multiple channels under the same Google account. After you set up a channel, you will be able to see the All My Channels link, a list of your channels, and the link to create additional ones. Now I will select the Cake Decorating Made Easy channel that I have just created to edit it. First you click on the tab, and then you will click in the channel name to edit it. In order to upload the icon for your channel, you just need to click the little pencil, click on Edit on Google+, and upload your image. The recommended channel icon size is 250 pixels by 250 pixels. You will click where it says Set as Profile Photo. Share something with it, and you are done. Now let's refresh the channel. Okay, great. In order to upload the top banner image for your channel, you just need to click the Add Channel Art button and upload your image. The recommended channel art size is 2560 pixels by 1440 pixels. Maximum file size is 2 megabytes. And click where it says Select. Okay, awesome. Now let's get back to the About section. In order to add the description for your channel, you just need to click the Channel Description button. Add your description and click Done. In order to add links for your channel, you just need to click the Links button. Something awesome in your channel is that you will be able to set up two types of links, custom links and social links. You will be able to place those links in the art area as well by selecting the overlay on channel feature. The first custom link should obviously be your website URL because you will be able to place just one of that kind of links in the art area. Let's add a second one. Let's add a third one. And finally, let's add a fourth one. You can add more if you want. You will be able to set up multiple social links as well. And you'll be able to place up to four of those social links in the art area. Let's put Facebook, Twitter, Google+, and Pinterest. Just remember to put your real social URLs. Remember to click Done. This is how the links will look on the About section once they are inserted. 
You can add more if you want. This is just an example. Now let's go to the home page of our channel. The YouTube URL address for our channel looks just ugly. What we need to do in order to change it is to go to the YouTube settings area and click on advanced and then create custom URL. Type an available username and click create channel URL. Finally, click save. And this is what our really nice YouTube channel URL looks like. Now we're done with step three. The time has come to do something that a lot of people skip before creating a video.